Sir Handel in charge. Sir Handel is one of the oldest engines in the hills of Sodor. He knows a lot of things, and sometimes he can be rather grand. He enjoys telling the other engines what to do, and because he is a wise engine, the other engines do as he tells them. One morning, Sir Handel puffed into the transfer yard. James was waiting. I have to take the thin controller to a meeting with the fat controller. Snorted James. Just then, Mr. Percival arrived. He was late, and he was worried. Sir Handel gasped, Mr. Percival. There's an important special today. I'd like you to be in charge of it while I'm away. Yes, sir. Chuffed Sir Handel happily. He liked the idea of being in charge. Now he could tell the other engines what to do. Workmen must be picked up and taken to the forest, Mr. Percival said. Sir Handel was excited. The trucks must be taken to the forest and filled with logs, added Mr. Percival. Then the heavy train must be delivered back here. Thomas is coming to collect it very soon. I'll find the very best engines, puffed Sir Handel. Ask the first engines you see to do the special," said the thin controller sternly. Sir Handel wasn't listening. He was thinking about telling the other engines what to do. The job must be done very quickly," cried the thin controller. "Don't worry," Sir Handel hooted proudly, and he puffed away. <laughs> I'm going to have a wonderful time," he whistled to himself. Up ahead, Sir Handel found Mighty Mac. He was helping workmen to lay the new track. I'm in charge of a very important special. I need an engine to pull a heavy train," Sir Handel chuffed. "We can pull a heavy train," wished Mighty. "We're very strong," whistled Mac. But Sir Handel wasn't listening. I must find the very best engines. You must wait here," he puffed grandly, and he steamed off. Next, Sir Handel found Rusty. I am in charge of a very important special. I need someone to pick up workmen," he puffed importantly. Rusty was very excited. I can collect the workmen. He hooted happily, but Sir Handel wasn't listening. I must find the very best engines. He huffed. Wait here. Then Sir Handel found Duncan and Peter Sam. They were racing down some twisty tracks. I'm in charge of a very important special. I need a fast engine to take a train to Thomas at the yards. Chuffed Sir Handel importantly. We can pull trains faster than any other engine. Duncan and Peter Sam puffed excitedly, but Sir Handel wasn't listening. I must find the very best engines. Sir Handel steamed snootily. You must wait here. So the little engines pulled into a siding. Sir Handel felt more important than ever. Then there was trouble. Sir Handel arrived back at the transfer yards. Thomas had already arrived to collect the special. Where's my train? Tutor Thomas. Bust my buffers! Cried Sir Handel. Sir Handel had spent so long looking for the very best engines. Nothing had been done. Now he was very worried. Your special isn't ready. He wished sadly to Thomas. Thomas was surprised. Can you find engines to start work right away? He tutored. Then I can still deliver the special on time. This time, Sir Handel was listening very carefully. 
He knew where all the engines were waiting. If I hurry, I can put the engines to work right away. Leave it to me, Thomas, he chuffed, and Sir Handel raced out of the yards. Sir Handel steamed over to Duncan and Peter Sam. Can you work on my special? he asked. We can pull the train along the twisty tracks to the forest, peeped Peter Sam. Faster than anyone, added Duncan. This time Sir Handel was listening. Please, start straight away, he wished, and he raced off to find Rusty. Rusty was still where Sir Handel had told him to wait. I can collect the workmen, hooted Rusty, and take them to load the timber. Please start straight away, Sir Handel huffed. Finally, Sir Handel found Mighty Mac. We can pull the heavy timber train to the transfer yard, wished Mighty. We're the strongest, whistled Mac, and they steamed off. Sir Handel had listened carefully to everyone. Now, everyone was working. The special will be ready for Thomas after all, he huffed. Later at the transfer yards, Thomas's trucks had been loaded with the timber. Just then, James returned with the thin controller. Well done, Sir Handel, said Mr Percival. Did you enjoy being the engine in charge? Yes, sir, chuffed Sir Handel. He felt very happy. He had listened to the other engines and now he was even wiser. Let's go!